All right, it's about stream 30. Let's see, let's get some audio going. Some desktop. All right. Play some Shadowrun tonight. Some Shadowrun Dragonfall. <clears throat> Through Steam. It's a game I got for free because I had the expansion on um, on uh, on Shadowrun Returns. <clears throat> Uh, and I guess they released the uh, director's cut as a standalone at some point. So we are gonna play it. I already played through the game. I played through the, the original. The, uh, I played through the expansion already. Before oh, this is a new picture. This is a uh, neutral sniper. But like it was pretty cool. Big old like female troll for the sniper. Yo. What up, dude? I'm gonna pull my volume way down. There you go. Got our volume down. I think I also need to switch my stream over. Come on. Twitch is silly. <clears throat> Shadowrun. Dragonfall. With Winston underscore Mars. <clears throat> Can you get louder? Can I? Yeah. Probably not. Okay. I've got my laptop, like, right on my lap, so... Oh, okay, so that's about as loud as you're gonna get. Um... Well, then, maybe what I'll do is... There we go. I've got the stream switched over now to Dragonfall. Maybe what I'll do is, in the game, see if I can't turn it down to be more quiet. Holy shit, what are you doing on your computer? <laughs> it's so loud. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. Okay. Yeah, I see the uh, I see I see the troll sniper is like on the main screen now. That's pretty cool. It's pretty pretty sweet. I've got everything up that I really needed to have up. I guess I'll pull up Streamlabs and Nightbot. I don't know if I need them or not. But... Okay. Streamlabs is not happy. Fine. Whatever. <coughs> My own Streamlabs. Alright, Streamlabs doesn't want to come up. Screw it. We'll do it live! <laughs> we'll do it live. Pull up my, my Twitch information. I've got this one to log in. What's that? I can't hear you. I said I'm just trying to pull up my Twitch information so I can log back in. Oh, sure. Got like this huge, like crazy Facebook uh, Facebook fight going down. That's hilarious. Uh oh. With who? Uh, it's not really me. I'm just kind of watching. 
um, just watching this, this, uh, the Subaru guys that are fighting, um, these, uh, these guys, they kind of just talk crap on each other, and, um, whose car's faster and whatever, and, and they talk about, like, who tuned their cars, and who blew up their cars, and things like that, and, um, these guys have kind of been going at it for a while, and so now, like, they're, one of them got in a wreck and told of his car. So, the other one's like, dude, that's what you get. <laughs> He's like, I hope you died, or I wish you would have died in that accident. It's pretty, pretty ridiculous. Very entertaining, though. All right, Shadowrun Dragonfall, director's cut. I'm sure I'll remember most of this, but uh, but we'll see what happens here. Here, range schemes installed, launch campaign. Okay, so the year is 2054. The promise of opportunity and anonymity draws you to the free city of Berlin, the flux state, grand experiment in social order. Corporations tread carefully here. Even the great dragon Lof... Lofweir only has so much sway in the constantly evolving power structure of Berlin. The perfect place for a savvy shadow owner to disappear and begin anew. If only it were that simple. Let's do it. Oh, and you can find more stories. That's right, I forgot about that. It's a really neat feature that they did in these. Um, I think we'll just do normal. I don't really need to do hard. Even though I've played the game before. Alright, let's see. Do I want to be a dude or a chick? I usually roleplay better as a dude. Uh, elf. Elf Decker. That's pretty much what we're going to be doing. So. Um, yeah, I don't necessarily know. I mean... I, Okay, so you can be a human, you can be an elf, dwarf, orc, and, uh, and a troll. And it uh, looks like they, they all have different stats here where it kind of adds... You know, you might have a different start to the game, or... Uh, you know, you yeah, all, certain archetypes. Um, yeah, everyone has... A little bit different. Like, your dwarfs might have strength, but maybe not the speed. Your orcs will have strength, but like no speed at all. Elves, you know, it, it's a balance, essentially. It looks like nobody actually adds anything to intelligence, which is the primary attribute for Decker. So that's kind of interesting. I guess there's not really any one uh, class that maybe it, it would be best for that. Intelligence, though, I think intelligence is what opens up your um, your advancements for like how you negotiate. Or how you talk, you carry yourself as a shadow runner. Well, that should be charisma, elite. shouldn't it? Um, hang on here. I got the email open right now. Well, the troll, the max is intel. Max intelligence is six. Uh, eight for orcs, nine for dwarves, nine for elf, and nine for humans. So really, everybody is like equal as far as what they could max out when using the decker or when using the intelligence attribute. But I mean, really. Let's see. Really, I just yeah. I just want to use sniper rifles, <laughs> and I want to be an elf. That's about all that is. You're right. You're right. Charisma does open up your um, your etiquette, is what they call it. Hmm. Okay, so now we're gonna find what avatar we want to use, and I'm guessing I'll be able to find. Oh. I can just use the blacked out one. That's kind of neat. Let's see. This guy back here kind of looked a little cool, except for the fact that his hair is blonde. And I don't really know if I want it. What? You kind of have to have white hair if you're Steel Flight. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here, here's the guy that I think looks the coolest. Uh, is right here. I think we got to go with him. Steel Flight. Uh, changed his hair color from Super Nintendo. <laughs> He's got short black hair now. <laughs> mm. Okay, we're gonna customize. Uh, let's see if we can get his skin tone to match. That's about it. The 
hairstyle. Okay. I really like the music in this game. I know. I think they did. Did you get the the DLC where you could download the full soundtrack? Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, so what is that? Just going to iTunes or something or what? Uh, I think it saves as like a zip file, and then you can kind of put it wherever you want. Put it, yeah. Right on. Um, I think I think I usually go with this hairstyle right here, the little the little faux hawk. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna darken his hair up a bit, so it kind of matches <clears throat> the avatar. I think that's probably decent. A little beard. He needs, a little, kinda, he needs a little goat. Just, you know, I'm wrapping up a, a battle on my end. Oh, yeah. And then once once I wrap this up, I'll just kind of start watching. Kind of help narrate with you. I think that's a little goat there for him. So now we got to get the same. i got to, like, really zoom in and, like, with my eyes and focus here. <laughs> okay, cool. I think we're... I do need the dang glasses, though. I don't think they let me do glasses. That's all right. Whatever. Okay, so we have eight karma. Can I start the game without using the karma? Whoa. Whoa. Because that's always what I want to try to do. You may spend karma at any at later at any time by accessing the character screen. That's what I like to do. I like to play games... Um, and you can't, you, you can't spend it during conversation. So, like, if there's a prompt that comes up that says if, if you have this etiquette, you yeah. know, to, to speak a certain way, um, you can get a clue or you can get karma or whatever. Um, you Unlocks. can't spend it during conversation. You can always back out of some, some conversations and then uh, use it and then come back. Get yeah. The info or whatever you're trying to get. Yeah, I remember that. Um, I don't know. I think that was always like the biggest thing was I wanted to be able to. I always wanted to make sure that I could. Um, I could go through their conversations the way that I wanted to. Let's see. Well, I need to make sure that I can use the right weapon. That's actually the most important thing. Um, so let's see here. Quickness. We have ranged combat. Pistol, SMG, shotgun, rifle. There we go. Aim shot. So I think... I don't want to go up to full auto just yet. I think I want to. I want to bring that back down. Okay. I feel like. Okay, that's five karma. I want to come back down and see what I can get going here on my on my charisma maybe. We don't care about willpower at all because we don't do magic because we're not dumb. Okay, etiquette. Uh, willpower, though, if you're gonna, I, I think if you jack up on like all the cyberware, it depletes either your willpower or your essence or a combination of both. Hmm. So like, I think if you ever get to a point where you've got too much cyberware installed, you have to either oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. give more essence. That's right. So, I mean, I wouldn't add to it right away, per se. Because, I, I mean, I could be wrong. I, I seldom play as a uh, uh, you know, uh, overly dependent character on cyberware. You know, I'll have, like, a da data jack and, you know, a board, but that's about it. Okay, um, let's see. So the etiquette... Yeah, that's right. So I want to be able to figure out, do I want corporate security, gang, socialite, shadowrunner, street, and academic? Now, I'm going to get... 
You think Shadowrunner would be good? It's not. It's not so much. Um, I like security, I think. Security is good, and then, like... Um, Street? Uh, no. Read them again. Corporate? <clears throat> security? Gang? I could see corporate being really good. Corporate, security, corporate. gang, socialite, Shadowrunner, street, academic. You'd be surprised sometimes academic leads to something, but I... I would at least do, like, security. I'm going to do security for now. I still have two karma left. And I don't have to spend it. Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't mean to do all that. Okay. Intelligence, throwing weapons, close combat strength, dodge, rifle... So let's bump our ranged combat up another one. Because I do. Doing a good chance to hit. I'm okay with leaving one unspent point, I think. I think we'll be alright. Oh! I get to choose another etiquette? For some reason? Okay. Um. What should be the second one? <laughs> corporate? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think corporate. I remember being a decent one. So name your character. Steel Flight. It's like the only thing that has to be. It must be Steel Flight. Most of the missions that you encounter in this, you're pretty much going up against like security teams. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's So if you can... If you can talk yourself out of a fight, you save yourself a lot of uh, headache. Yeah, exactly. Um, I was really hoping to pull... I wonder if I can buy... if I can pull... I guess. <clears throat> okay. Let's see if it runs okay. Alright, I think we're good to go. Oh no, I shouldn't have clicked on that. I wanted to read the damn thing. Harfeld Manor, 2054, one hour east of Berlin. State grounds are silent, save for the faint whistling of the wind. Your team gathers near a side entrance to the old castle Holdfast, cloaked in darkness. The night is peaceful. You know it won't last. You know it for what it is. A pleasant illusion that will shatter at the sound of the first gunshot. Monica, listen up, folks. Monica Schaefer. You ran with her back in the day. Now she's your team leader. Your decking skills may be sharp, but hers are Nova hot. Running with Monica is like taking a master class in icy braking. We're on a tight timetable. I want to enter the castle, find the basement, open the data vault, extract the files, and bolt. Ten minutes, top to bottom. Dietrich. Trying to get home in time for worm talk, love. Dietrich, shaman, the old man of the team. He smiles at her, his facial tattoos writhing in moonlight. Monica's eyes twinkle with mischief. Maybe. How many times have I told you? You can't trust anything that comes out of a dragon's mouth. That trid trash will rot your brain. She grins. It's educational. Besides, there should be a milk run. Security, yeah, milk run. I'm, <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, security is supposed to be light. A few automatic weapons, no armor. With a little luck, they'll never know we were here. Okay, what do we have here? In my experience, there's no such thing as a milk run. Glory, words of wisdom from our new edition. I agree with Steel Flight. Glory, razor clawed street samurai. Her voice is cold and neutral. Her expression, placid. They may only be private security, but their bullets don't know that. I can patch you up if I have to, but I'd rather not have to. You people need to relax. We're professionals, remember? Monica raises her arm and speaks into a wrist mounted comlink. A darkened face shimmers on the view screen. Iger, are you in position? <gasps> yes! Iger, I love Iger. 
The comm link crackles and the response comes back low and soft. Softer than you'd expect from a troll. Affirmative. The alarm lines have been cut and have a clear line of fire on the estate service entrance. When you enter the building, the path will be clear. Excellent. Thank you, Iger. Just doing my job, Iger out. The comm link goes dark. Monica winks at you as she drops her arm. See, we're professionals. All right, people, enough chatter. Our client wants the data from the vault, so we get him the data from the vault. <laughs> All right. Quick, quiet, and quick. He said quick twice. <laughs> she grins. Worm talk is on tonight. Glory raises his eyebrows slightly. I told you, it's educational. All right. Get your stuff and we'll head in. Grab your gear from the van. Pick up. Let's get it. Grab a weapon. Grab the rest of your kit. I will grab a weapon. Grab the rifle. Grab the rest of my kit. Grab your running gear. I always saw, I always saw Steel Flight as more of a easy kind of guy. You, you shut your mouth. I I gave him brown hair. <laughs> All right, so we can explore around a little bit here, which I always like to do. Kind of map out the area. You know, can't do anything else over there. I think the graphics in the game are awesome. I think the environments, the, the ambiance. <sighs> I think they just do an awesome job in these games, man. Okay, so we can go around the side. Looks like we got some solar panels upstairs. All right, let's enter the manor. Keep the team alive and get to the lower floor. All right, Monica, Glory, Steel Flight, Dietrich. You know it's kind of funny. What's that? Today I just started kind of humming the some of the ambient music. In this game in my head. Yeah. And I, I didn't realize it, but the melody I was humming was actually from the Sega game. <laughs> nice. Like, I knew the Super Nintendo one. I feel like. Can I inspect these things multiple times? No. Okay. So we're in the museum. We're going to go ahead and look around. It's always good to have a look, get into the game. The vase in this case <laughs> looks both very old and very valuable. A fine scroll look of lapis and gold leaf decorates its exterior. And the interior shimmers with the organic beauty of abalone shell. The fixer could probably move this thing in a heartbeat. Can't help but notice that the glass is encasing it. Looks awfully flimsy. Smash the glass. Nope. Walk away. I don't feel like breaking into it. That's not my play style. It's not my style. Okay. Alright, this looks like a nice place for a battle, which we, we we may have had to do if uh, if we smash the glass. Okay, that's locked, which is probably where the bad guys are going to come from. I don't know, do we want to explore down here? We're going to run into security team. We probably should just go, yeah, exactly. We should have just gone straight to the back. <laughs> that's alright. Okay, so I want to walk right over here. Oh, I missed him. What a dummy! All right, so we're gonna we're gonna bring in everybody real close here. Take the security guard out. Curious to see what's gonna happen if we kill this guy. Is there still gonna be? I think you can end turn. There we go. Oh, yep, they are bringing enemies in. Okay. So we screwed up. All right. Let's see about getting some good cover from everybody here. And we can reload by clicking that. Okay. AK-97. 
Monica okay she she's just gonna have to chill out Monica has not shot anything Dietrich well, let's stick Dietrich over in the corner I don't like Dietrich anyways we'll see if we can coax these guys in through the corridor and whoa he's got a shotgun All right, we're gonna see See if we can't bring him into this choke point here. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. We'll end our turn. See if the other guy will come in closer. We'll end the turn a couple times. Don't think he's coming around. We'll reload. And he's still not coming. So. No, move up. Okay, we can see him now. But I don't have a very good place to hide. Hmm. We'll bring everyone up in, into this same room here. End the turn, see what happens. Okay. So she does have medium cover. Which I can get some better cover over here. Ah, go to sleep. Okay. So, we've won our first battle with Shadowrun Dragonfall. Decking 2, override matrix operations door lock. Yeah, let's give it a shot. There we go. Okay, so we've unlocked the door. Uh, I think we can go back and get the vase now. I kind of feel like doing that. You can try it. I think it'll prompt you out of it. Oh, like they won't even let me, maybe? Like, like a team member will say. Yeah. Uh, oh. Better not do that. It actually only gave me the option to walk away, so. Hmm. That's. That's fine. I'm gonna. Let, uh, gonna let a buddy of mine know that we're streaming. Send him, send him a message so that he knows we're streaming. Maybe come watch a little bit. <clears throat> okay. Oh, yeah, the door's unlocked now. We can come in here and see what we got. We got any toys? Ooh, we got a jack in port. Select a decker to jack in. I think we need to use this chick. Because she's a baller, and I'm not. Okay. Jack in. Oh yes, I remember this. That's so funny. Okay. And we gotta we gotta kill this stuff. Okay, we're gonna come over here. Oh no, that was really bad. That was not good at all. <laughs> <laughs> I, I definitely misclicked. These guys aren't touching me anyways. Take them out. Gotta keep them separated. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Alright. Oh. I'm a little bit disappointed in this run. The run that you're doing? Yeah. That's not good. Well, 
Long story short, last time I played it, um, like I didn't have all the advantages of, of the state shutting down certain security and making use of my decker, so I ended up fighting a lot more guys. And on this mission, it says if any of your team members die, they don't come back to your stable. You know, there's no retreat because, well, I won't give too much away, but, um, but man, I overdid it. There was like no competition, and I bought a lot of those uh, dock wagon cards for nothing. Oh. I need to kill my. <clears throat> Dude, I think I'm buying a house, man. Like, my buddy, my buddy's selling his house, and it's it's nice for like being a single dude. And I think I'm gonna strongly consider it. All right, let's see if we can bring everybody back here to where they need to be. And Dietrich. As usual, we'll stick him in a dang corner because he's terrible. He's probably actually not terrible at all. I just don't like using magic users. He is kind of weak. Is he? Right off the bat, but he, he improves rather quick. Like his magic skills. Wow, she's, she's doing a pretty good job there of hitting at 32%. She hit twice. And I missed. I missed twice at. Uh... Oh no! Oh no! What are you doing? Oh, well. I don't know. Dietrich had to run up like super close to be able to. Okay, we got four people over here. Uh... Mod me or riot. <laughs> That's, uh, that's my buddy. That's my, yeah, dude. He's, hail to the king, baby. <laughs> Alright. Let's see if we can't finish this guy off. It would be kind of nice. I don't think she can actually see him. You can be a mod. Is this going to kill my game? It's gonna, I better save, because anytime I go out of the... Anytime I alt tab, it screws with with the thingy. I feel like it. You already have like the thing right next to you. Oh no, it's Twitch Prime. My bad. Let's see. There you go. Now you can patrol my. My chat. What are we doing here? Who can we hit? Oh, yeah. We got the Grenadine. Oh, no. I don't like that. I don't like that she runs so stinking far forward. No, uh -oh, I'm not doing what I want to be doing right here. Can you kill somebody? Son of a gun. I need to get... I need to get these guys. Oof. Wow, he's like really messed up. He, he took a seat right there. Okay, we need to start hitting some people here. There we go. Um, I think we'll bring you back over here. You can aim, can't you? Dietrich needs to backpedal like crazy. What's what's the lag time in your um, from your actual gameplay to your Twitch stream? I would say ten to fifteen seconds, maybe. Okay. <clears throat> Go to sleep. Swag. <laughs> uh, okay.